Hello everyone. In today's video and the series we're doing, Preparing Your Future, we're talking about another one of the top five documents that you need in your estate plan, and that is the patient release or the HIPAA authorization. And why this form is important is that under the laws, uh, the, the HIPAA law, um, even your spouse, even someone that is as close to you as your spouse, is not able to view your medical records. Uh, the doctors are not permitted to give your sensitive information uh, to your spouse without your consent. And what the HIPAA authorization and, or the patient release form does is you are able to give your consent on that form to certain people that you name. Why this is important is that typically you will list the person on the HIPAA release or the, the patient release form that is the same as who you designate on the durable healthcare power of attorney. And if you haven't seen that video, please go back on our Facebook page and check that out. We have a couple videos in this series so far, and that video will explain to you what a uh, durable power for healthcare or a patient advocate allows uh, your designated individual to do. But the, the HIPAA release or the patient release is important because it gives that uh, patient advocate uh, that you've designated the ability to review your medical records and make an informed decision on how uh, they should be able to care for you or, or better understand your your uh, current situation. So that is why it is important to have a patient release in your estate plan. If you would like to set up your um, estate plan or get a patient authorization set up, you can give us a call at 248-702-5282 or you can message us on Facebook or through our website, radsmanlaw.com. Thank you, everyone.